Hello and welcome back to Sashtopia. I hope you're all well today. So I have a brand new game for you. So this game out came out on the 26th of October 2021. So, enter the mind of traumatised World War I veteran Alexander Doctor and experience the terrorising nightmare of trying to escape a sinking ocean liner while being haunted by the most terrifying entities you've ever come across. So, there was a demo released for this game. Um, I never got the chance to play it. I was going to play the demo um, over the last week. Um, well, over the, week, over the weekend that's just gone. And unfortunately, I, well, I couldn't find it. I don't know whether the developers took the demo off because of the release of the game. Um, so I just thought, you know what, I'll wait until it comes out. I haven't seen any gameplay of this because I didn't want to spoil it for myself if I did decide to do it, and obviously I have. Um, and it looks, from the like pictures and the trailers that I've seen um, on the actual store page on Steam, it looks absolutely terrifying so I thought let's give it a go let's terrify my socks off <laughs> <laughs> okay stop rambling so let's dive right in no! under depths of fear well this looks like this is could be Locked, so I don't know. So we'll go a new game. Oh. August 1917. The Great War has now rumbled over Europe for three consecutive years. Its horrors have claimed over 10 million lives. The life expectancy of an average soldier in the trenches is now nearly six weeks. As the entirety of the waters around the United Kingdom are now war zone, German U boats have already sank over 4,000 vessels, both military and civilian. Celtic Sea. Ooh. aren't very very good are they a bit blurry I need some I need some glasses Ooh, okay what's this crew meal times oh pick up an infantry water bath Stands for left mouse button. Duh. Okay. I can see a little bit better though. Okay. Do I just walk into doors? Looks like it. And they were thinking, okay. Ah, what's this? Rooms. Can't interact with anything just yet. Okay. No. We'll carry on then, shall we? Down here. Board storage. Oh. That's good. What's this? 
Box of three matches can be lit with right mouse button. Okay. Is that everything? So I've got three matches. Lovely jubbly. A uh, defiled photograph of Latoon. Okay. Um, I don't think there's anything for me just yet. Uh, carry on this way. Oh, this is eerie. So we're on a war, a warship by the sounds of it. scroll mouse to rotate uh, okay we look like we need a oh no oh I've wasted a, a match that's no good oh this is this is not great uh gate lock oh gate lock code six is that did I say six lock number six oh T to read Okay. No, stop it! Oh! I'm getting so confused with my buttons. Ah, oh, I've wasted my matches. Brilliant. Great start, Sasha. Great start. Okay, so we want... There's no six. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, okay. I wasn't looking at the bottom. Silly me. What's this? Some kind of medical document. Critical med file three. Iron rod case. Unknown cal cavalry soldier found conscious with four foot nine iron rod planted through brain. Patient was transported. To nearest departure to England within 12 hours of discovery. Day one of transport. Patient conscious but clearly delusional as a result of grave brain injury. Noted to be rambling about morbid topics irregardless of commands and requests to stop such vocalizations. Day two of transport. Patient started developing infection around wound area and slowly started screaming that developed into a con conscious scream of agony. Patient was given rum and later morphine to no result. Night of day two, patient was found dead in his ward bed. Oh, okay. That's, that's, that's not good. Keys. Oh shit. Oh god. Use control to cap crouch. Uh ward office is instruction binder. Utilize a route for early emergency. Only use B route in lockdown. Yeah, that's why it told me to crouch. Oh god. Is 
some of those break well by running into them. Okay. Notice. Well, we've got no matches now. Oh! What happened? <laughs> okay. Oh, it's so dark. Okay. Oh, so it looks like we're in the engine room. me to grab here, so. This one is a key. Oh god. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Fox 3 matches. Yes! Thank you for listening to me! This way to the stern. Am I the only person on this ship? Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Uh, okay. Is there anything for me in here? Four. That does what? Boiler room long. Do I need to make all the lights green? Okay, I've, I've done something. I'm not entirely sure what I have done, but I've done something. Oh. Ow. 
running around like an idiot. This way to stern. Like I... Okay, I'm just gonna keep running. What? No. Wow, this game's so confusing, guys. Are you kidding me? Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> okay. Oh, you ass wipe. Wait a minute. There's what coming in. Are we. Ah, uh, uh, I had to leave for two seconds. Okay. This isn't good. Oh god. No, you're joking, you are joking, you are joking. I'm on like a timer now. Oh, this is not good. Out of the way. Oh god. Shit, shit, shit. Like, why can't I run? Why can't I run? No, why can't I run? Oh god. Oh god. Helmet with holes on the sides. I need some matches. Okay. I can't run. I don't know where I'm going. I've got no matches. It's so dark, I can't see. Okay. I wish I could run. Oh, this is so, so spooky. Like, I don't understand why all these are here. Hang on a minute, I've just been there. Oh, I have to step over it. Oh, dark. Oh, God. Oh. God, what is this? One more man. Something have my soul. <laughs> oh, you fucker, it's a coffin. Oh my god. Oh my 
god. Okay. Okay. Um. I don't know where I'm going! Can I get up there? How do I get up there? How do I get up there? Oh, what do I do? Oh no! This is not good. Okay. Oh, what are you kidding? Um, do I have to press all these levers? I don't know. Oh, God. <gasps> yes. Okay. Okay, I made it. I don't know if I had to press all those levers or not, but we pressed the one that made it look like there was a um, ladder coming down. Okay. Whew. Panic over. Right. We are sinking. We are sinking. Something has definitely happened to our warship. Save our, save for our troops. Okay. Um. Okay, what's this? Um. Yeah, because that's not creepy at all. Okay. <clears throat> A letter sent from the trenches. Dear Amelia, today was our first day on the front since we arrived from training. I'm quite impressed by the conditions, not all as bad as I expected. I must insist, we have to visit France after this war is over. Anyway, after a day of mostly getting our trenches combat ready, I gathered with my platoon members and have to say that I get along quite well with these chaps. We have a shared spirit for adventure, although th there is one man in particular who quite concerns me. I believe his name to be Alexander. He visualises a man who has no ambition for this war, and the worst of all already seems frightened throughout the entirety of the day. I'm truly hoping that he will man up. Our officer clearly told us that every man needs to work together for our platoon to be combat effective. I'll write to you soon. With love, Lewis Thompson. Am I Alexander? I can't remember. Hmm. I can't get through that door. Ugh. Oh, there's a door here. That's where the music's coming from. So nice game of all things. Aww. This one says, To my dearest family, it seems my fate is grim. This morning when when drawn arose, the Scottish unit went over the top. Those screams and shots will never leave my mind. Souls. The most peculiar thing happened though, two moons ago before their departure, some of their lads kept our spirits up with some of that strange Scottish banter. They spoke of this legend called Black Donald, a goat-like creature containing only Luc Lucifer himself. He is summoned when one lets others, others down and when one puts their own life before others' lives. After the slaughter happened this morning, our unit peeked over the dugout and saw this dark goat walk over no man's land. This walk was si eerily slow and his steps resounded like wooden blows, echo echoing in the dead fields. Soon after he was gone, when you read this, know that my thoughts are with all of you. Love, James. That's a bit weird. That's why we've got this. Ill. Okay. This need not be a solitary topic for you. For your departure, there's a need for you to dispense with me. Now tell me. Ugh. I heard them speak of it. He was there. There was always general word of his existence. Put on this arm and chase the those who fence for themselves only. Never had I seen them. Now when did you hear of him? And what was the name he went by? 
shift while walking to just to push them. Okay, maybe we can't go through that. Okay. What? I'm not gonna go with that was a ghost because we are on a ship and I know stuff can move around. That just seems like a pointless room, closet, hallway. G deck. So we are at the kitchens. Mm hmm. Is there anything I can grab? Like some matches? That'd be nice. from danger. Oh, is something gonna ch oh something's gonna chase me. Are you kidding? I don't like this. I don't like it at all. Okay. After all that's trace been around, I missed the beads of matches. I has matches. I'm so scared. Oh no. <gasps> oh my god!
I did not like that one bit. Oh, okay. Can't go up there. We have to go down here. Fuck. Okay, that was definitely not there the first time. Oh my god, I'm so scared. You don't honestly, I don't understand how much my heart is racing right now. No, you idiot! I keep pressing the wrong button and using my matches. <sighs> okay, he's gone. Okay, there's a key there. Oh my god. Oh, the water's coming. And there's rats. There's rats. What the fuck? Okay. This is terrifying. <clears throat> okay. Case files. Facial construct case for a corpse of Highland Platoon member was retrieved after fatal attack in order to implement medical revitalization experiment following procedure according to Second Life Act. Face was successfully masked with plaster reconstruction before vitaliz vitaliz mm -hmm. vitalization procedure. Procedure deemed unsuccessful after revitalization. Revitalization left patient with animalistic tendencies. Patient is to be returned to state of deceased on night before return to mainland. There's there's a lot of um, dead people on this on this ship, um, and I don't like the fact that it's. Oh, 
I don't, I don't like the fact that it's... Kind of in a way have this like deep panic in me with it sinking as well a bit so I can not that it's I can kind of imagine what it must have felt like being on a warship what was sinking or even the Titanic because I'm panicking because now I can't seem to find anywhere that's <laughs> got a key and this water's rising and rising and rising. Okay, um, I'm scared I'm gonna drown. Oh god. Yep, something's happening. Oh, this is not good. Where the hell is the key? Ah. Uh. This is no fun. No fun at all. July 5th report, he has escaped the grave, he will never escape those he left to rot. We're always behind you, just watch. Some kind of message for me? I fucking hope not. Why is he just watching me? Instead of just watching me, help me. Ah! Okay. I have acquired the key. I need to find the stairs now. Oh, that was more successful. I don't know how I did it. Honestly, do not know. Um, I'm gonna go back through this way. Where are the stairs? Where? It's like, it's such a maze. All the stairs. Oh god, no. This is ridiculous. I, mean, I can do this. This game is so hard. Right, we want those. Yeah, okay, take them.
Oh no, it's locked. That's why I couldn't find the stairs. Oh my goodness. Ah. Found it. Oh, thank God for that. Right, okay. Let's get this door unlocked. Um. Oh. No, that's the way I... Okay. Yeah, that's creepy. Oh, I can keep this door. Are you serious? <gasps> this game is horrendous. What is this? It needs a fuse. Okay, I've got a, a key. Key, key. Honestly, the worst part about this game is the fact that it's just a maze. And you have literally no idea where it is. Ah, that you're going. Okay. Break the fuse box. Cool. Let's get back to this room. Um. Now what? Is that it? I assume that's what we do. Ooh, we're in the posh part. It's changed. This is very fancy, isn't it? Lots of rooms. Ooh. Oh, is this like a spa room? Ah, some more latches, yay! <gasps> I've been finding so many more latches. Oh, this makes me so much happier. And another projector slide, so we've got a new memoir. Memoir!
this at all. Oh my god, what is that? No. No, he's like really tall. He's gonna kill you, he's gonna kill me. Uh, I don't know if he's stuck. He looks like he's stuck. Um Give us a good dance you're doing. You're really tall. for hours now I'm hoping this saves I assume it does why would you buy a game that doesn't save but I think I'm gonna leave it there because whew, this game is so scary like so scary so that was um, under depths of fear I can honestly say that is probably the most terrifying game I've ever played and I think it's because I didn't know what to expect from it. It's a little bit stressful at times. The only downfall I would say about this game is the fact that it gives you next to no hints about where you're meant to be going. I spent a lot of my time um, which you won't see because of the editing, I will have cut a lot out. Is me running around in circles, literally not knowing where the hell I am going. But that's fine, like, I don't mind that. I got there eventually. It just takes a little bit for working out to do. So it's like a puzzly type game and you've got to run around. But that bit where the water was getting fast, that was making me panic because you don't know what's, you don't know what's around the corner. You don't know if there's something gonna come and chase you. And also that feeling of you're gonna drown if you don't hurry up and I'm not saying that I can say oh I, I now know what it feels like to have been on the Titanic or on any shink shinking <laughs> sinking ship because I don't but I, I kind of have that little bit of imagination now like I can kind of imagine now what that would have felt with with the panic that i was going through like oh my god quickly i need to do this quick i need to get here quick and i can't find nothing's opening like that that bit of panic but i like the way that it makes you feel because that's what a horror game should do i would 100 percent recommend this game if you haven't tried it absolutely terrifying 
Okay, I hope you enjoyed today's video guys. If you did, then please drop a like and hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't already, ring that notification bell so that you can stay up to date with all my latest videos. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.